So the work that's in this show, Flow, is really highly conceptual. It's all linked. There's some very traditional practices, but non-traditional materials. And then there's also technology here. So I, I want to make sure that the viewer can understand how the works are related. So I was in the woods uh, in the Adirondacks, and I literally had a wooden shingle on my lap. I'm sitting in the woods, and I brought my watercolor paper with me. And I took leaves from the earth. I rolled them up like in little cigar shapes, and I drew with the leaves. So there's no artist pigment here. It's all the pigment from the leaves, the red, the green, the yellow. It's all from the woods. At the same time that I'm drawing, I had my iPhone sitting on the edge of this wooden shingle. So the process of drawing is making the shingle move and it's making the shingle vibrate. And so when you look at the videos, some of the images begin to disintegrate or vibrate. And so it's the action of drawing that's making the video. And that's why I call them process videos. And so the sounds that you hear, the scratching that's sometimes very slow and rhythmic and peaceful, but other times it's more energetic or sometimes it's even frantic or frustrated. These are all the acts of drawing. So, and they're beginning to get louder now. Um, I have them looping on three minutes. Some of them are as short as 30 seconds. Some are a minute and a half. But inside of three minutes, they all repeat so that sometimes there's very quiet moments and then sometimes they're all coming up and they make a cacophony. Then there's one piece that I call a keystone piece and then this piece, this piece is that wood shingle that had a knot hole in it. Um, and I, I, the dying sun, the, the setting sun, I set up the shingle so that it casts the sun on this rock. So it's moving very quickly. It's recording for us the passage of time because all of this is about how fast things really change. You know, these pigments are no longer available. The season's gone, you know. Finally, the last part of the show, that same wooden shingle that has the knot hole was used to make these pieces. And so I took videos holding the shingle with the knot hole and moving it through space to be able to uh, capture perception of the landscape. And those are called View Lunar Knot Holes 1, 2, and 3. Thank you very much.